a rare picture, an overhead shot of the Abrams prototype with 140 millimeter gun with the latest images of the M1 Thumper prototype, a unique version of the legendary M1 Abrams tank, equipped with a 140 millimeter gun and automatic loader, have appeared online. Developed in the late 1980s, the Thumper was designed to significantly enhance the firepower and penetration capabilities of the existing M1 Abrams, which typically features a 120 millimeter gun. M1 Thumper, distinguished by its enlarged turret, designed to accommodate a formidable 140 millimeter gun. This development was intended to provide the tank with higher firepower, which made it more effective against heavily armored opponents. The prototype underwent a series of rigorous tests and evaluations to assess its performance and viability on the battlefield. Despite the promising progress in firepower, the Project Thumper was finally postponed. The decision not to continue production was influenced by several factors, primarily the high cost associated with the development and deployment of a new version of the tank with a larger gun. In addition, advances in ammunition technology for the 120 mm gun used by the standard M1 Abrams have helped maintain its combat effectiveness, reducing the immediate need to upgrade to the 140 mm gun. For comparison, a similar project was carried out by Germany for the Leopard 2 tank. This involved the integration of an automatic loading system for a 140 mm gun, where the main gun was located on the left side of the turret and the ammunition was stored in the turret bustle. However, like the Thumper, this project was also shelved at the end of the Cold War and never entered the battlefield. New images of the M1 Abrams Thumper have generated considerable interest and debate among military enthusiasts and defense analysts. They provide an insight into the ambitious efforts that were made during the Cold War to increase the firepower of tanks and adapt to new demands on the battlefield. 